every day when you look in the mirror, are you reminded of the day that you were shot? I'm always aware. As I'm talking to you, I'm aware. Mary Jo. Mary Jo Buttafuoco made worldwide headlines when she was shot in the face by her husband's teenage lover, Amy Fisher, AKA the Long Island Lolita. The shocking shooting 25 years ago left Mary Jo with a partially paralyzed face and still to this day, unable to smile. It affects your self-esteem, it does, when you know you can't put on a big bright smile. After the shooting, her husband Joey served six months for statutory rape. His 17-year-old lover went to prison for seven years. And here I was out in public with a very paralyzed, disformed face. In 2003, Mary Jo and Joey finally split. And all this time, Mary Jo remained upset by her physical appearance. This year I had a hard time with it. I had a really hard time with it. Her damaged facial muscles also seemed to be deteriorating. This down here is paralyzed. You can't, you can't get that back. Her daughter Jessie says repairing her mom's smile would mean the world to them. She doesn't think of herself as pretty, beautiful, and it's completely the opposite. She's the most beautiful woman I know inside and out. Now, only Inside Edition is with Mary Jo as she meets with Dr. Bob Akazizadeh, a surgeon who has developed a pioneering procedure that he believes will fix the smile that haunts her daily. I'm so excited for you. There are certain muscles that are really obstructing her from smiling, so we're gonna rewire her nerves. With a thumbs up, Mary Jo is off to the surgery 25 years in the making. The doctor begins by marking where he'll make incisions. Now the tedious process of testing each nerve in her face. He uses a nerve stimulator to tag which microscopic nerves are working and which are misfiring. Believe it or not, some of the nerves are actually causing her smile to get worse. Next, rewiring her smile. He is one of the only doctors in the world who performs facial nerve surgery. He also gives Mary Jo a facelift to even out how she's aging differently on both sides. Surgery went great. Mary Jo's daughter gets word the surgery is over. I'm a little nervous. She's nervous to see her mom for the first time. Two months later, Mary Jo reveals her astounding transformation. It's the first time in 25 years that you know, when I smile, you can see this side of my, my teeth. Look at Mary Jo before, and here she is after surgery. Look at us! We caught up with her at an event for the Facial Paralysis Institute. Look at you. Even her doctor's impressed. So is her daughter. It's amazing, it's phenomenal, I love to see you smile. Congratulations, Mary Jo, on having lots to smile about. I love it.